Hey everyone, my name is JK, your host for today. NUS Sync is the one-stop platform for all CCAs. In this video, we will be covering some of the basic functions of events, forms, and news so that you can get the word out on about your student organization activities. The event tool on NUS Sync allows portal administrators to create and manage your organization's events within one central location. Alright, let's get started. Switch on your Manage view to assess this organization tools. Select your switchboard followed by Manage. Under your Manage view, assess the list of organizations that you have administrative access. Now, select the organization that you would like to create an event. For me, that is NUS Sync Student League. Assess the organization tool drawer. You see a list right here. Click on Create Event and begin creating away. So I've created an event just for the purpose of this video. Fill in all the required fields like event title, theme, description, start and end date and time as well as location and required positions. Once you're done, don't forget to complete the rest of pages and click the submit button. Okay, so right now, if your event is open to the public and it requires conditional logic and personalized reviewers, switch to forms by accessing it via your organization tool menu. Next up, we're going to move on to forms. To create a variety of forms using the forms tool that are suited for various purposes. Select the Add Create Forms and begin customizing your form. At this page, you would be prompted to identify your form properties where you would have to include a list of details such as your name of form, start, end date, and time for collection of details, whether you would like to feature it on Explore Forms, create a reviewer workflow, and many others. For a more detailed explanation on form properties, you can refer to this website, as shown on the screen. Thereafter, create questions for the form by selecting Save and Add Questions at the bottom of the page. You will then be directed to this page where you can add questions. You can select the question type from this list as you see on my screen. Once the form is created under the Form Properties, do remember to set it as an active form to open it for registrations. Select Share Forms and copy the URL to include it in your events description of EDM to your members. For more information, assess the Portal Administrator's User Guide and head to the section on Forms. Once you have your event and form in place, you can then proceed to draft a news post to publicize your event. Select News under your organization toolbar. Select Create Article and begin drafting your news post. Ta-da! That is how you can promote your event. Try to give it as much notice to your members as possible so that they can have plenty of time to prepare for your activity.